our lives and fatherhood in general. My name is Firma Adunami. And my name is Hato Kwamna. So, but before we go on, uh, let me just mm -hmm. ask Firma, yeah. what is one of the most fondest memory you had with your dad? Like, like Right, now? so, um, hmm. I know my dad is watching, you know, okay. and uh, I always remember when I was very little, my dad would carry me shoulder high and just walk around with me, you know, that kind of feeling, you know, sometimes be dancing, spinning around. I mean, anytime I hear Luther Vandross' song, Dancing with My Father, okay. I, I kind okay. of feel that he's talking about my dad. Wow, interesting, interesting. No, but what is your fondest memory of your uh, father? Before we go to my fondest memory, let's mm -hmm. just hold on there. Mm -hmm. So, the Luther Vandross song, you know it. Yeah, of course. Can you can you sing it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So in true upside down style, I'm going to make no, Freema no, you're sing. not going to make me sing. Freema just do it for all the fathers in Ghana. Yes, yes. If you want Freema to do it, keep clapping. Mike, I just going to do the song for her dad on this Father's Day. Are you serious? Can I just have a mic for Freema? <laughs> no problem. Okay. No, we'll have it. Thank you. All right. So, uh, oh, producers. Give me some beats. Yes, our producers will drop. Yes, beautiful. <laughs> oh, I see. I don't do this. <laughs> Problem. If I can have a mic phone, let me just do this with you. Are you serious? Of course. I, no, you want to do this? Yeah, of course. Can I have a microphone? Yes. I, 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 I told you want to do this. Yes, I want to. Okay, get a mic. Are you sure? Thank you very much. You want to do this? Let's do this together. Do this okay. Okay, bye. Do one line, yeah, we'll yeah, do the yeah. other. Oh, yes, you are ready? Yes, I'm ready. So, so let's do this for me. all the fathers in the world. Okay, That's something else. <laughs> but when I was a child, before life removed. All the innocence My father will lift me high <laughs> And dance with my mother and me and then Spin me around till I fell asleep Then up the stairs he would carry me mm, And I knew for sure I was loved If I could get Another chance Another walk Another dance with him I'll play a song that will never ever end How I love, love, love To dance with my father again If I could seal one final glance, one final step, one final dance with him, I'll play a song that will never ever end. How I love, love, love to dance with my father. Today on Upside Down, as the world celebrates fathers and father figures, we will do the same. And in true Upside Down fashion, we do it with a twist. We have fathers and father figures who are truly worth celebrating on the show today. Simon, who entered fatherhood abruptly with the death of his wife during childbirth. Veronica 
who is playing the dual role of mother and father to her five children, and later, Mr. Asante, a grandfather caring for his granddaughter with cerebral palsy. They join us here on Upside Down. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. This is Upside Down. Thanks for that you guys should stay after the break. Um, guys, we always want to hear from you. The WhatsApp number is 055 and the hashtag is Upside Down. I can see you guys tweeting at us, sending us messages. Happy Father's Day to all of you. Mm -hmm, and um, mm -hmm. we're going to go into a conversation uh, with yeah. the father. Yes, yes, yes. yes with a, Well, he is a very special father. I mean, all fathers are special. I'm going yeah. to be giving my Father's Day message because I know that my father is watching. <laughs> hey, Papa. But, you know, this gentleman that we are going to be mm. talking to has a very unique story. I mean, we all have dreams you know of fatherhood we all um anticipate what it would be like mm. to carry your baby in your hands you know uh, with your wife by the side and the journey begins i mean yeah. you having to mentor somebody biologically is yes. really a blessing yeah. but when the whole thing turns upside down mm. then there's a whole new story to it yeah. now this gentleman we're going to be talking to has a peculiar story you know his joy 10 saw right at the time that he began his journey into fatherhood let's just um take a look That's at a how story. his story unfold on the day that should be the happiest as he welcomed his son into the world turned out to be a nightmare for simon as he lost his wife in the process The whole thing happened when she was pregnant and due to deliver. So it was 2nd May 2019. I just didn't know what to do. My body was shaky. I barged into the world. At that time, then they now brought in the baby to the corridor. But for hours, they didn't bring him. When I started complaining, then they brought him into the corridor and started feeding him with some liquid. Then quickly, they said they need blood for my wife. I need to get arrange for blood. At the same time, I need to take the baby to Zao. So I became so confused. I didn't know what to do. I thought because my wife was with experts, it is important I go with the baby because I don't know what will happen there. So I still trusted the doctors that once my wife was done, she was in safe hands. So when I returned, the atmosphere in the ward told me something. I felt to read myself that my wife was gone. Simon, who is suing for wrongful death in the passing away of his wife, has had to raise his son single-handedly as a new father. Apart from having to think about widowhood and the fact that my wife is dead and all that I've gone through, I have to subject her to another pain, agony, of having to see my boy suffer every passing day. Every report so far indicates that the boy suffered a condition of a prolonged labor. Prolonged labor with doctors who are paid with my taxes. And now they tell me they are not responsible for her death. It is me that is responsible. The small, small salary I get is what I used to feed him. So he tells you what I've gone through, and by the grace of God, he's responding. Yeah, we are celebrating fathers, we're still honoring them. So we have Collins with us in the studio. Guys, let's give him a hand of applause as he joins us and tells us his story. Collins, glad that you can join us. Have a seat, have a seat, have a seat. Welcome, Collins. Thank you. How are you? I'm good. Really good. So, so how, how has life been, you know, the past one year? Honestly speaking, life has been terrible. Yeah. Extremely terrible. Mm. Tell us about it. How is baby doing? Well, he's fine. Mm. What's his but name? He's Felix. Felix. Felix yes. Tikolibe. Nam. Nam. Okay. All right. So, so um, when a wife told you she was pregnant, when you knew that we we're going to be a father, is this your first time being a father? No, I've been a father before, yes. Okay. okay. But how special was this one for you? It was special because this is my wife and this is her first child. 
Okay. okay. Yes. So, so your first child wasn't with this? Thing. No. Mm. Okay. No. So this one was particularly special because this is a woman that has been your backbone mm. over the period. She's very understanding. So mm. it was good mm. to share a child with and to mm. know that you are sharing a fatherhood with her. Mm. Yeah. So it was just all joy. Mm -hmm. Yes. Right, and then everything that has happened, um, we, we just played your video, and so we know mm -hmm. how the journey mm -hmm. has been like. I mean, you lost your wife, you know, at the moment when you thought that you could take your bundle of joy, you know, in your arms and both of you go home. So when the baby was given to you, I mean, now you realize that you are a daddy. How was it like? Yes, uh, it, it, the whole thing happened at exactly 12.30 when the news came in. A.M.? P.M. Okay. Mm, in the afternoon mm. that the baby had arrived. Yeah. So I was just in, in a thankful mood. I began to thank God. Mm. Well, it's been long hours of pain and agony. You could feel it. Mm. And so if the baby is in, I was just thanking God at that time. Yes, I was mm. in a thankful mood. Yeah. Mm. And then what happened? Sharply, it turned the other way around. And I waited. I was expecting them to come. Uh -huh. Let me see my wife. Let me see yeah. the child. It never happened. And so one will say that the last time you saw her was the time when she told you she was dying. Mm. And indeed, it was that time. So that is the memory that has been left to battle with. When it finally hits you that you had lost your wife and you had this baby, like what, what actually went through your mind? How do you go past that? How did that journey feel like? Uh, another problem altogether would have to start. You know, that day, fortunately, my mom had arrived. Mm -hmm. And so I was just standing. And then they discharged him to me, and I took him. And then my mother took him. Because at that time, my mother knew what was How, how did it feel? I mean, when oh, your, yeah. your son was handed over to you? <laughs> It's just terrible. It's something you just can't explain. It's an intrinsic situation here. So, for me, yes, I was pre-informed that look, no matter what, the child must not feel what you are feeling. Mm. So, any time I'm, I'm appearing before him, I try to wear a good face, mm. a good posture, to make sure that yes, he also have that. With the bonding, he'll be fine. So I get to him and I pretend that you all was well. But mm. you see, you have to balance between happy and being yeah. in grief. Yeah. That is a situation in which I found so, myself. So while you wear a smile on your face, mm. holding your baby, what goes through your mind? What goes through my mind is having to nurture a child as a father without a mother. And he's a boy too. So you have to think about what he should eat. He has not got breast milk. Mm. So you have to think about what he should eat. What you should do. Because what the mother would have done, you have to assume that position. Yeah. Yeah. So it was a whole lot of things. Leaving the premises of uh, uh, Saom, I didn't even feel like walking out. Mm. Because remember, on a Saturday, she died on Friday. On a Saturday, we had to come and convey the body to Nsawom. Mm -hmm. So you actually get to the mortuary before you enter the hospital. Mm -hmm. So she was just with the baby there. Mm -hmm. So any time I get to that place, it hits and you then it's like, go, don't go. And my pastor will tell you, any time we get there, my mood changes. Mm -hmm. So before we transit into the hospital. So when we're exiting, I just stood by the mortuary and I was just looking. Nobody will even allow you to go there. Yeah. So it's like I, I left something behind. Just get up, let's go home. Mm. Just get up, let's go home. And every time the torture, because you have to always be there. You have mm. to always go there. Mm. And so I didn't have any choice. That is what they have given to me. So you have to face life unexpectedly. All right. So, um, you know, um, Telling us how, what you've gone through, you mentioned your pastor, you mentioned your mom at some point, and your friend. How has been the support from uh, the community, your family, and, and everybody else? As for, as for the family, yes, the community, like I, I indicated, my pastor should be the first person, Reverend Doe. He's been very helpful. He'll come around, pray with you, mm. encourage you, and he's always in touch with me, my father, my mother. The entire family, everybody, my in-laws, mm. my mother-in-law, mm. 
I owe him so much gratitude. Mm. Look, she's always with me. Mm. And there's no day he doesn't come to me. Mm. She always come to me, sit with me, mm. talk to me. But she's been my source of inspiration. My mm. mother-in-law has been extremely helpful to me mm. because he's not feeling fine. Mm -hmm. uh, you would have assumed that once the mother is gone, you have a baby, a healthy baby, who will be active and doing everything yeah. as every child should do, but mm -hmm. you don't find it that way. What is wrong with him? He's not feeling fine. He's been down. The, the, first, the very reason why they diagnosed him and admitted him there has not left him. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Even though you will see that he's somebody who really wants to live, mm -hmm. he wants to have life like every other child, mm -hmm. but no, the, the condition will not allow him. And then so as of now, he's not able to sit. Mm -hmm. He's not able to crawl. That is a situation we, we, we so, have been faced with. Okay, so let me, let me just ask this one quickly. Um, um, what would bring you the, the joy? The closure. That, yes, the closure and then um, the utmost joy from your son. What would you like to see your son be? That would bring you so much joy. Uh, I, I want my son to be like any other person. To be like the son of the director general of Ghana Health Service, mm -hmm. to whom I went and who never saw that he was a human being. I want my son in that capacity. I want my son mm -hmm. to feel proud that he's, he belongs to a sovereign country like Ghana. I want him to do even better than me, mm -hmm. so that in the future, where the mother ended, yeah, he I want him to at least be an advocate okay. for women empowerment. Mm -hmm. It is one thing I want him to do. Right. So uh, I want him the faith. His mother suffered. He will not suffer that fate. Amen. Amen. And may it Amen. be so for you. What was baby's name again? His name is Felix, right? Felix. Kufi Nam Tukolibe. Right. So, um, Collins, you've really done very well, you yeah. know, and um, we are proud of you yeah. as a father because it's not easy for those who even have their wives next to them. Yeah. Is The journey is not easy, but for you to enter fatherhood this way we say that well done and that is why we celebrate you yeah. today and wherever felix is our love and prayers are with him and we know Sorry. that he will grow up to be that advocate that you are hoping he grows up to be and don't forget to always pray for him so we have something little yeah. for our son and um our baby Let's clap you this. know you know how we do an upside down you know how we do an upside down yes If you know someone doing something extraordinary in your community, we will love to meet them. Share their story with us via email to cityupsidedown at gmail.com. City TV is live on DSTV. Go to channel 363. On Go TV, access City TV on channel 182. On a digital TV, Please press the menu button on the remote control and run a new search on your TV. Take note that without an antenna, you cannot access City TV on your television. City TV can be accessed on a free-to-air digital box like the Go TV and Star Times box. City TV, it's your world. Imagine if you can get all the understanding on some of the difficult subjects you struggle with in school. As a student, do you feel dissatisfied with how hard it is to figure out the subject you're learning? Or as a parent or guardian, do you worry that your child is struggling to understand some of the subjects in school? Well, now you don't need to sign up for extra lessons or tutors. Simply tune in to Class Act, Mondays to Thursdays at 5.30 p.m. on City TV. Class Act is a show that seeks to enable senior high school students gain a much better understanding of what they 
grade learning school. All you need is a TV, a chair, your notebook, and your pen. Get clarity on subjects such as maths, English, IT, and science. Class Act airs every Monday to Thursday at 5.30 p.m. on City TV on DSTV Channel 363 and Go TV Channel 182. Don't forget your pens, pencils, and your notebooks and tune in to Class Act only on City TV. Yep, 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 right, yep. welcome back. This is still the Upside Down Show, and today we are celebrating Harvard Hood. You know, I mean, most of the time you get to meet people who do not have children biologically, yeah. you know, but they've played very, very important roles in the lives of so many people, yeah. and so they are fathers to these people. Now, you even sometimes come, um, you know, you, you meet women who have done extremely yes. well. I mean, people who have to play the role of, of, of a, a mother father. and yeah, also a father. father. You know, sometimes when I was growing up, my father traveled when I was very, very young. And mm. so I know how it feels like when a woman has to play both mm. roles. There were days that my mom would cry, you know. Yeah. And growing up now, I think I even understand her better, you mm. know. And so yeah. for me, I think that just as, I mean, for somebody like um, Collins, you know, on Mother's Day, mm -hmm. I think we should be celebrating a person like Collins because to be given a fresh baby, yes. you know, no yes. breast milk, no nothing, and you have to nurture this baby. I think that if it's Mother's Day, we should be calling such people who are playing the roles of mothers. That's and right. so it is also very ideal and appropriate yeah. that on Father's Day, people, you know, not just males, I mean, you just don't have to be a male to be a father, yeah. but people who are being you know fathers people who are, have taken up that challenge upon themselves to make sure that my husband might not be there the father of my children might not be there but i am going to stand in yeah. to be that father that my children would want and so on father's day especially i look at children like that who do not have fathers yeah. on father's day who do they say happy father's day to? true that's true that's true um also coming i'm coming also from a background where um both parents live together, but um, I saw my mom most of the time. My mom brought me up, and um, my father is a very wonderful person, and I love him for that. Um, but my mother has been a father in the early stages of my upbringing, and then um, I it's it's just something else, like you're saying, the responsibility of taking up being a father. Yeah. For, especially for two boys, yeah. for in my mother's case, was was something else. And then we have every right to honor and celebrate people like that. Yeah. So in true upside down style, we have a very compelling story. And we're going to meet a mother who actually became a father. So let's look at the story of Auntie Vero. When she lost her husband years ago, Veronica was thrust into the role of mother and father for her five children. Your baby, I'm in the Kuare, nineteen years. Now, Obeyare, into Obeyare, one year, four months. Now, Fena Penny, every SS. Now, second one, also, Ewo, SS one. No, but good two. And now, third one, also, before SS one. Now, Papa, need to free me. Celebrator right here on Upside Down. Right, ladies and gentlemen, so Veronica is right here with us and yeah. she joins us now. Let's give her a hand. Let's give her a hand. Woo. You can do better, you can do better. Wow. Mommy, you're welcome. You look beautiful. Thank you. How are you? I'm good. Mm. How are you? I'm so, fine. I'm mm. fine. Um, when we were watching your video, you were telling us about losing your husband and all. Oh, when did you lose your husband? What happened to him? Obeyare. Mm. You were 19 years. No, Obeyare. You were one year, four months. You were in a year, you were in a year. You were in a year. No, yeah, mommy. To be free, mono. No. Para five, nay, nay, easy. Nothing a penny, every essence. Not a nay, easy. 
to me as an uncle, so called a university, no, yes, said Dabby. You know, no, so you rise as one to me, son, and hope it's true. And to a chain cacra, and to any film or no co university, no second, third, never was so university. And to your madam, first, none of me, cha, na ed. The so bar, my old bar, sign a bim. Say, Bibia, sister, very, my man is an old frame. To be a sister, very best song. Omoko screwer, a German back of penny sicker, or betcher, the amobia, Moko screwer. Also, Bibia, and you may say, say, be busy, me crew, must hear a frame, say, me and choir. Me, I must hire a barn, me, I'm easy, Kaja. Now, my son, I am your dear, call my man and papa, so tears. My son, I'm a choir, may buy my son, but twice, so when I may have a cross, a bed made man, I mean, say, Oh, finance, TV, say, ya. As I saw more to me, she is on the court will be at them. As a man, I'm a sense, yes, 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 Mm -hmm. So how how many years have you been doing this? When yeah. did your husband die? Oh, eleven years. Wow, eleven years. So how old are your children now? To see, I've been in thirty years. In the second, I'm twenty-eight. Third one, I'm twenty-six. Now when we were by back, we know twenty years. My last one, know sixteen years. Mm -hmm. So so we know how teenagers behave yeah. you know five children how were you able to discipline them mm. 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 because bright future mm. And the same baby, to me, I don't fool be a friend part. That a very dean, the balance here. My friend is no be a witty in here. What for the cannibal, no matchy, no media coffa. That would hear me be doing a mere matum, no man, no more balance, dear man. So I balance and see her. No, no, me do. So, how, how, how. What what are some of the questions that they usually ask, especially when they ask where their parents are, like the last one? Last one, we decided to say, "O kai ne papa na," because papa we not finna kunya five years. Mm. We say na sunpe no de kai na, mm. because ne papa na o asun kakra mm. na sunpe na o de kai na. But why why didn't you marry again? <sighs> okay, I marry any day. It will not mean same. Me an kasa me ni ni ame kasa e. Sebeya, or Donny Betram and Uncolan, and tell me to me, I show me ye tea. May ye, my home, Juma, first name a tongue, may I meet ye tea, stories and go for my real one now. Now, my first mean yan said ye, mean yan, no, no, would be on all banasso could tell my old man Colan and ye, or be mammy problems in Timmy. I make a sa say, Oh, woman, I mean to me, shame me money in ye, and son, I will ever ba, a ba, and tell me saying, I make a say, oh, ye, your boy. Yes, mm. So, um, so, yeah. so eleven years ago, when your husband died, that first year, you and the children, how did you survive? Me ye a juman and son will be. You could now and ya a bany juma or ye business to a yarian a business Nicholas here into a man at eighteen with your new being. But you need be even Papa and own Papa cry fearful and cry still a big crane in Monkalano. Tia Jumana, the corner say, and time and say, one bar. To be quite the mammy, me, mm. the soon send the corner and top pet, me risk can be a singer, me born me to me tongue. Do bass too soon, a young cat and cat, a dying soon ye. Advance, me in the sick at all. Say, be as a tense this year. Me to hold on, 
so so when they ask you for something and you are not able to give them, how do you feel? Mm. Mm. If you can have some tissue, tissue. yes, double bear. You know, you mentioned uh, in your story that um, during the time that your kids had to go to the university, it was really tough for you. How did you manage it? University, no. Nothing. And you know, you're not going to be a baby. You're not going to be a baby. Maybe <laughs> One of to the beer, and why a deep We are now afraid. Was a chronicle school, dancing bachelor divy, will be a webbian so uncoy. I'm one and so he was okay. Now, can I come up now? Was any scar? So, how would you describe your children? Man, mm -hmm. a mm -hmm. Just a penny now, Wow, second wow. Wow. On the last last February, I'm not worried. Two bear grandmother, ain't she? My yet, that okay, second okay. one. No, so I love you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, so yeah. I know you love your children yeah. very, very much. And your children love you too. Too much. They love you very much. So let's hear some of the things that your children say about you. Mom, the rule. She is a single mother of five. A single mother who has ungrudgingly taken us through education, primary, secondary, and tertiary, has been a provider. In fact, our full provider. And most of all, has taken us through the fear of the Lord. It has always been her fervent prayer not to see us go astray. And, and indeed, she has made sure to serve as both our great daddy, our sweet mommy, and let me even add, our sweetheart. <laughs> My mom has been both a loving mother and father to us. When I was going to school, Whenever I go to school, she buys my provisions for me she, and then she gives me enough money to support myself at school. My mom has been able to play the role of a father and it hasn't been easy. Looking at the difficulties she has been through, she has been able to I mean, <laughs> take us to school. Um, from basic and um, secondary and now I'm in my final year so so she's also a kind of mom is very caring loving and also like the way she is you know, she's always keeping on encouraging us sister very you had your children yeah. so on father's day what happens? Some of the money. Mm. Or mama or gifts. Mm. Mm. Then how do you feel? Good. Mm. I think I, I think Auntie Vero just deserves a hand of applause. Let's just clap for her. Yes, and um, like we do two outside down so we have a hamper ready for Auntie Vero to honor and celebrate her this father's day. Marvel, you well. So I think great. on this special day, we mm. say Happy Father's Day to you. Yes. And um, this is a token from us. We just want you to 
have this. I mean, have a good time, you know, to do cook something beautiful for you and the children. And any time you wear this cloth, just remember that there are some people here at City TV. There are some people in Ghana, some people in Africa, everybody watching you who are very, very, very proud of you. We pray that God will bless you with long life and make sure that you stay alive for us to see all your children graduate, marry, and have beautiful grandchildren and beautiful grandchildren. Preach on, Thank preach you. on, Amen. preach on. I think so, you can do it if you have to preach. <laughs> Anyway, so this is for so you. This, thank you very much. Yes. All right, all right, all right. So, guys, uh, outside that was still happening. The WhatsApp number is 550 Let's hear from you. But then we go for a quick commercial break. When we're back, there's more right here. If you know someone doing something extraordinary in your community, we will love to meet them. Share their story with us via email to cityupsidedown at gmail.com. Comprehensive news. The City Newsroom at 8 p.m. on City TV is your most engaging news bulletin on TV. It's, it's a very... Act oh, that's, that's too bad. It, the youth are still throwing stones. They are still throwing stones here into our direction and can i come in i want to come in okay telling your stories better with correspondence covering every corner of the country getting access to potable water is a daily struggle for residents of kakiche kopi and balekopi communities in the Abda east district of the greater Accra region city newsroom at 8 p.m very fluent with issues that concern you with City Newsroom, your community is now connected. In this our community, all of us are very sorry about this school. If we went to see the children, they are so small, so good. even my grandchildren are there, my grass outside there. If they come out of the school, I have to be safe. Every day at 8 p.m., City Newsroom is live on City TV. back to upside down sorry fathers you guys have been doing the most um we are honoring you today your influence to the community is just beautiful it's just beautiful we mm. have amazing stories today yeah and uh, we have one more to go mm -hmm. Hmm. so like, things are happening yeah. things are happening things you know are people are going happening. through all kinds of things you know yeah. just to make sure that their kids you mm. know get the best in life well i hope children are watching and yeah. they're really um, appreciating what parents are going yeah. through you know what fathers are going because through. Because we suffer. We have to let them know we do suffer. So anyway we're going to speak to a father of fathers um, a grandfather who has an amazing story and guys let's just have a look at this. Mr. Asante gives the ultimate sacrifice as he is a caregiver for his granddaughter who suffers from cerebral palsy. Mr. Asante has cared for his now 8-year-old granddaughter and goes over and above the call of duty to provide a safe and caring home for her. We celebrate him right here on Upside Down. We indeed wow. celebrate Mr. Asante. Who is here with us 
such an amazing story. I, I, I don't even know where to start from. Daddy, are you cool? Hey. Oh. Mr. Asante, how are you? I'm fine. How is Insura? He's fine. So, when did you start taking care of Insura? Can I go on, Chief? Yes, yeah, you can. Yes, okay. 2014. Okay, 2012. Mm. And I didn't have one and a half years. And since then, I'm a have a sister. Who brought? Who brought? My daughter. Where's your daughter? At Kumasi. But why did your daughter bring? She's she shivers. Um. Not in the also. Yeah. Why? Oh, my God! I said, I award in so. She was not so, um, 2014, and you didn't buy it. I'm mm, didn't buy 2012. Okay, so when they brought her, what did they say? Oh, say, oh, one in China, I said, brain tea and soon muka cry. And tea, or didn't bring any mother. I am my wife, but my wife was almost way age. Now, me, the name of pension tea, I said, me, I'm taking child. So, how has it been like taking care of her? Uh, so, okay. so, so what exactly is the problem? It's a problem with the doctors. Mm -hmm. According to doctors, you know, on the on the asem, on kasa, and now after the muso, is it the on the midrans? The midrans are on the midrans. And see, at, at what point did you know that the baby had a problem? Time of feral cultural. Okay, or who no choose? And according to him, or we and our feral mammy, mammy, a cook, a calling chain or commerce. According to my wife, or no, is it two weeks? No moon say we soon we soon in the day. You didn't call midwife now or call away and all. Now, I'm calling a doctor and so we be on your own yard. You almost had any birthy, but on birthy and still. Then you almost had any coin to only call by view. No moon say a few as a wada. And now, my wife will cancel a joy. In Shira, the Ubana Dan was my young man, and I always say was Susa, not Moses, say no cocoon. Ah, so then what happened? T. Ayana Muman, so nobody in a co, Masi G. That's come for not teaching hospital, yeah. T. Oh, more than one, 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 a minute and over. Was no timidity in the only pipe for two names, nobody or CG seen so. I said, okay, can you? I said, I'm a doctor. 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 You are an old. I mean, you are old. You know, yes, how old sir. are you, if you don't mind? 72. 72. Wow. wow, God has given you the strength because you need it. But a 72 year old man doing all this, carrying your baby because she looks a bit heavy. Mm. How, how is it like for you? Well, uh, 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 I take in no more. I say, Yamina, the man, Yamin Suna. Yamidia, Bibian Suna, a bit of us one day. Obey Bibia, go so say. Dacro Bacoyene, if you have him, if you have him, see any Dacro. The bit of us one day, but sorry, no, sorry. Yeah, not be a one day, so that's all in no call. What motivates you? You know, she's not talking, she's not seeing. She is not hearing. Mm. She is not sitting. She is not walking. What motivates you? And then that does show in cry say, "Koswaye de oye no." I mean, say one day nyami be. Nyami ayi. Eh, nyama mi no. I da say one day obeko. 
na we be at church and I say one day obe sorry nti no nya me mu arishi I don't even know what to say mm -hmm. because I have children mm -hmm. yeah. and I know how it feels like you know when your child is even sick just for a few days I know what I go through so for you to take care of a child like this you don't know when she will be fine mm -hmm. she may or may not be fine mm -hmm. what do you tell God do you believe in prayer yeah okay so me elder I will have a seven day Adventist okay. 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 and then what do you tell your God Oh, make a chance in your media. Some meaning is any amity or no be anywhere sooner yet. And you know, a breast him on a one shining one with him. There were no young men some. I'm holding in the air. Yeah, yeah, bear the cry, caraway, on sorry, I'm on sorry. Your men said, yeah, be being sunny yet. And to Miss Rain, I may say, won't we a mob? On fun and sun can, on sunny area. Do you think your granddaughter is in pain? Pain. Yes, of course, or bread. How do you know? How do you see? What does she do? So, or bread, I say, or bread, because one way, eh, 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 and I say, oh, yeah, no, dear, cry, or to me, baby, visa. So, what time does your wife come home? Sometimes four o'clock or three o'clock. Does she sleep alone? Many mm. neda, I sleep with her. Wow. Many mm. neda. <sighs> my wife, they know that they were a form by being a man so many way. So one day, if may God forbid, you don't get the healing you are looking for, and you mm. wake up and your granddaughter is no more, how would you feel? Me then I'm here. Why? Because we see Papa Obonyi, we am fast at Are you tired? No. Will you be tired? No. This is be a medal. Hmm. Hmm. Mr. Asante, hmm. we've done well. Hmm. Why are there? You were a good grandfather. You know, yeah. I, I didn't come to meet any of my grandfathers. You know, so I really appreciate grandfathers and I think Inshra is blessed yeah. to have you. Hmm. Oh. Why, why is she doing that? <laughs> she was responding to you saying that her, her grandfather is so, blessed. So can you tell can you tell when she is happy? Nani jawo? First any day, oh my, na we ni see we bumi se wa osre. Kakre bi nu eje. Do anye bibia. But when we were watching the video, when you were feeding her. I saw you like rubbing the hair. Yeah, sometimes when you say, Oh, you didn't know, oh, me and I know, oh, me and I know, oh, yeah, and I say, Baby, who's there? Titini, Titini, who's there? Who taught you that? I'm in a mama, a coin. Wow. A cray bow life, Mo, would you say that has brought you some blessings or suffering? Or bow a bra boom, a din shabia bro, and I say, or brandy dorsal. Or brandy dorsal, but me and Hammy and I feel so. And I'm not doing to you or way and chain or how would you answer? No, yes, say the boy, and if you are the boy. Nishimo, how do you get money for the upkeep of the baby? I am you. Let me toss it. How? I will cost a sebby. Oh, ma, a damn, you are chairman, and I'm a catcher in the Israel. If you knew the bombay and I know the phones, you know, I'll make it pay the coffin. When I send this, you can go and call for me, I won't want to make a cracker. Wow, I'm lost for words because I, I don't I don't know how how to even comprehend what goes through Mr. Santa's mind every day that he wakes up for the past 80 years. To be doing something this amazing for Ishira. Um, I must say you're a blessing. I must say you were indeed a blessing. Who are you uh, looking sometimes for? Sometimes yeah, you say, yeah, I'm not a man. 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 I'm not a
Hone ni mame da soare. Now, have you tried, you know, talking to doctors? Nechino, can they do anything about it? Nechino, I'm not in the first time. You know, they didn't call in some orthopedic. And I almost say case, you know, as a scene. In the almost direct here, we are a focus. And I call it the honor. I'm can say that I'm going to say you saw on the in the own bed, in bed, surgery, no marking soon. And then you moon so much as a mobile. But twenty fourteen scan or a genuine twenty five thousand Ghana cities. Twenty five thousand. Mine, yeah. So that's why you couldn't do it. And the um, say twenty sixteen one. And they sign a coach, a key, a coach, a key, and I do thirty eight thousand. Now, 25 for cry and you know, 38. But what do you wish for her? Oh, me, me, say, I'm saying, can you move anything? No, I was sorry. And one, me, me, come on, I mean. Because, may God forbid, if you die and leave your grandchild, obey a day. And they uh, 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 very serious. Do you uh, think about it? Yeah, we do. If you go and say you will cry, say me yari da wa be be hard being far because and then just say oh my man, I'm going to be fun at the echo. You they say that you are and then they and they up 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 a coffee, sir, and then some moons I say, aging and you hear me say. A Jumal, Mr. Santi, God bless you. Amen. It is the only thing we can say because ah. watching the baby, I'm, I'm, I'm down, hmm. but you have the strength. To do this, it is well. Because <laughs> your your strength will also fail you. Do you think about it? You are growing. They say to me, man, is what I said. Their first now, man, is so now. So, so are you looking for help? And as I say, because I'm one now, man, you know, you've just given up. Oh, uh, I'm one day because see, I cram now. It be I'm coffee twice. Mm. Mm. Okay, I'm say the coffee suit twice in tea now. It be an I it's a health insurance in tea. I am a bet transportation. I'm doing a community me for him for total because total crowd the nickel for a senior tier. I am go for cry to you. Do a crowd and chamber. And now, oh, say, will be all you are one coming behind you, but we turn and chamber. If you in a crowd, yeah, war or war by the day. Oh, and I want to compound house. In total sense, and none of you say. I didn't so bad, and then say, Oh, near three is be our bed in ten. I can't, I would say, Oh, him say, Well, me, I mean, anything in him say, No, oh, because me, not that the test for almost eight years. That's your grandchild, and somebody is describing her like that. Oh, so what help do you want? I see, yeah, yeah, I'm saying, I may be here, Mobona, one day, no, say. Corner be cockra fine. Obenya who are doing so. No sorry, no sorry. I don't know. Me In two the local fees, yeah. How much do they charge? Because health insurance in Tia na. Ah, um, Tia Bibi. The transportation in Tia na. Yeah, say me for taxi. Say no. In two week be a no. One million. Na me deko. Which year say? One million. Hundred cities. Yeah. 
You don't I, work. The, your wife is a cleaner. Yeah. What and work I, does your daughter do? Mm. Insurance mother. That person not a hairdresser. But oh we na ya any bass and yeah yin. A juma bayes basa and a baby and no or ye juman kasa crano. If you run a j na yin tin. See near man kitten kitty bin or tum tum. Miss Asante. God bless you. Amen. We are all praying. I want to just give him a hug right now. <laughs> God bless you. God bless you. Oh. We know that one day <clears throat> your prayer will be answered. Amen. Yeah. One day, we'll be the sorry, then Yeshua is fine. Yeah. You've been an amazing grandfather. We don't usually meet fathers like you. God bless you mm. and give you the strength. Today we celebrate you yeah. Amen. for this amazing work. All right, guys, let's let's give Mr. Asante a hand. Uh, this this story is amazing, and uh, as we're doing today, we're going to present a hamper to him in honor of Father's Day. Um, Mr. Asante, this is for you. We just want you to enjoy every bit of it. May this be a seed to give you strength and to keep you going and do what you do. We thank you. We appreciate you. Even though I'm the whole movie and so on, I need you all. Is there? You must say every power. So now we did that kind of bit. Now, but I believe that you're not correct. I'm sorry. Yeah. Amen. 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 So, <laughs> this, has been this an is it. Time. Yeah, yeah, compelling uh, stories that we have here. We have amazing fathers out there. Um, there's not much to say. Yeah. When you bow down your head to pray, please do say a prayer for fathers, especially those who have to deal with situations like that of Mr. Mr. Asante. Asante and also of callings yeah. and also of women who have no men in their lives and they have to stand, yeah. be the husband and be the father as well. This has been Upside Down. My name is Pumadu. And my name is Asa Palmer. And I want to give you another opportunity to just wish her father a happy Father's Day. So your father is watching, I know. Yeah. <laughs> so you can just wish him a happy Father's Day. Dad, I want to say thank you very, very much. I've been through so many things in my life. You have been a pillar in my life. I can't sit on TV to say the things you have done. Mm. But in my heart, mm. I cherish you. Mm. I love you very much. Thank you. All right, and to my father and uh, my mother, who happens to be the second father in my life, um, I appreciate you both this Father's Day. You guys have been the reason why I'm here today. And um, you guys, your influence will, con will continue to bless the entire society. This has been Upside Down, and uh, we'll catch you guys same time next week. Stay safe.